Now to an incredible story of survival, triumph, and rebirth for a local rapper who suffered amnesia after a car accident. For nearly three years, he's been trying to rediscover who he is and who he was. Today, Paula Tutman shows us how music has been his guiding light until he saw a new light at the end of a very dark tunnel. His given name is Jimmy Brown. But in the music world, he was known as Supa MC The Immortal. Brown keeps a smile on my face, knowing that you say I can't continue my day. The rest of Jimmy Brown's life started October 10th, 2020. After a car accident, he doesn't remember. In fact, after a day in a coma, he didn't remember much, but he does remember being in an abyss. It was like space with no stars. Like, like imagine space with no stars folded on top of itself like three times. And you looking through the folds. That's how dark it was. When he came to, his life was a mystery to him. A popular local rapper who appeared in Eminem's movie, Eight Mile, his brain injury was so severe, when he looked in the mirror... I'm looking at stuff like, you know, like, that just can't be me. He didn't recognize himself or his family, not even his wife. I mean, my wife's pretty as hell, so when I seen her, I was like, you, she was like, you my wife? I'm like, yeah, okay. All right, yeah, for sure. <laughs> yeah. But in that abyss from the coma, the man known as Super MC the Immortal became acquainted with someone else. One aura appeared. Then another one. And they were looking into me, and I was looking into them. And, um,. They started to tell me that they loved me. God is what brought me back here. God is what healed me up. He started rebuilding his life and rebuilding his music. Woke up in the hospital, walking confused. But his voice was different. Not his speaking voice or his rapping voice, but his creative voice. This message is basically my ode to God for, for not casting me somewhere. With everything I asked for, I got it to pray and sing like shit. It's not a gospel album. It's just somebody telling you some real things about God and what it, and, and what life enthralls or what somebody went through. Because I couldn't have overcome it by myself. It had to be a bigger battery power in this than me. It had to be a miracle that I survived. So, as I said, before he was known as Super MC, the immortal, and turns out he, he may have been at least just a little bit when you go by how he survived this accident. So, got a new music release. Party coming uh, July 23rd, Avalon Village in Highland Park. And now, as Super MC Obsidian, the Fallen One, I guess you could say he is new and improved. Paula Tutman, Local 4. All right, thanks, Paula. And the public is welcome at his music release party next Sunday at Avalon Village in Highland Park, which will be both a listening party as well as a block party.